Saudi Arabia has centuries-old attitudes and traditions, often derived from Arab civilization. This culture has been heavily influenced by the austerely puritanical Wabi form of Islam, which rose in the 18th century and now predominates in the country. Wabi Islam has been called the predominant feature of Saudi culture. Saudi Arabia differs from other modern Muslim counties in being the only state to have been created by Jihad the only one to claim the Quran as its constitution, and the only Arab Muslim country to have escaped European imperialism. Its Hejaz region and its cities Mecca and Medina are the cradle of Islam, the destination of the Hajj pilgrimage, the two holiest sites of Islam. Islam is the state religion of Saudi Arabia and its law requires that all citizens be Muslims. Neither Saudi citizens nor guest workers have the right of freedom of religion. The official and dominant form of Islam in the kingdom, Wabism, arose in the central region of Najd, the 18th century. Proponents call the movement Salafism and believe that its teachings purify the practice of Islam of innovations or practices that deviate from the 7th century teachings of Muhammad and his companions. Saudi is one of the few countries that have religious police, known as Haya or Mutu'een, who patrol the streets enjoining good and forbidding wrong by enforcing dress codes, strict separation of men and women, attendance at prayer, salat, five times each day, the ban on alcohol and other aspects of Sharia, Islamic law. In the privacy of the home behavior can be far looser, and reports from the Daily Mail and WikiLeaks indicate that the ruling Saudi royal family applies a different moral code to itself, indulging in parties, drugs and sex. The kingdom uses the lunar Islamic calendar, not the international Gregorian calendar. Daily life is dominated by Islamic observance. Businesses are closed three or four times a day for 30 to 45 minutes during business hours while employees and customers are sent off to pray. The weekend is Friday to Saturday, not Saturday to Sunday, because Friday is the holiest day for Muslims. For many years only two religious holidays were publicly recognized. Id al-Fitr and Id al-Adha. Id al-Fitr is the biggest holiday a three-day period of feasting, gift-giving and general letting go. As of 2004 approximately half of the broadcast airtime of Saudi state television was devoted to religious issues. 90% of books published in the kingdom were on religious subjects, and most of the doctorates awarded by its universities were in Islamic studies. In the state school system, about half of the material taught is religious. In contrast, assigned readings over 12 years of primary and secondary schooling devoted to covering the history, literature, and cultures of the non-Muslim world comes to a total of about 40 pages. Fierce religious resistance had to be overcome to permit such innovations as paper money, in 1951, female education, 1964, and television, and the abolition of slavery. 1962. Public support for the traditional political, religious structure of the kingdom is so strong that one researcher interviewing Saudis found virtually no support for reforms to secularize the state. Because of religious restrictions, Saudi culture lacks any diversity of religious expression, buildings, annual festivals and public events. Celebration of other, non-Wabi, Islamic holidays, such as the Muhammad's birthday and the day of Ashura an important holiday for the 10 to 25 percent of the population that is Shia Muslim, are tolerated only when celebrated locally and on a small scale. Shia also face systematic discrimination in employment, education, the justice system according to Human Rights Watch. Non-Muslim festivals like Christmas and Easter are not tolerated at all, although there are nearly a million Christians as well as Hindus and Buddhists among the foreign workers. No churches, temples or other non-Muslim houses of worship permitted in the country. Proselytizing by non-Muslims and conversion by Muslims to another religion is illegal, and as of 2014 the distribution of publications that have prejudice to any other religious belief other than Islam, such as Bibles, was reportedly punishable by death. In legal compensation court cases, Daya, Non-Muslim are awarded less than Muslims. Atheists are legally designated as terrorists. 309, 
Saudis or foreign residents who call into question the fundamentals of the Islamic religion on which this country is based may be subject to as much as 20 years in prison, and at least one religious minority, the Ahmadiyya Muslims, had its adherents deported, as they are legally banned from entering the country.